Medal. And then there was one match to go. 70 kilos, let's do it for gold medal for these European Championships. Mustafaev of Azerbaijan, Mustafa Kaya of Turkey. Kaya, Mustafaev, Turkey, Azerbaijan for the European Championship at 70. Mustafaev in the red. He was the one who upset the Russian four to three in the quarterfinals and then Start. reached the semifinals with a 12-2 win over the Armenian wrestler and David Safarian and took care of Koja Karu in convincing fashion, his route into this European title. Early shot here by Kaya. And look at Azerbaijan come back with the two. Beautiful. Snuck his head to the opposite side. And what he did was he kept that left elbow tight and was able to work to that opposite hip and pick up the first two of this gold medal bout. Kaya is one of those guys for Turkey who's always right around that podium. He had a couple of heartbreaking losses in bronze medal matches in the world championships in both 16 and 17. Had a good world wrestling championship last year in Budapest. Off to a quick 2-0 lead more than a minute into this first period. Contact. See those fingers and the referee jumping in, that finger locking and the emphasis on that call last year really has picked up the offense in, in wrestling. That can be such a, a slow down mechanism when applied, it just slows everything down. So these officials really quick on it. Anytime you see the fingers interlocking, sometimes you see the ref jump right in and swat the hands away. And there it was again, referee stepped in and Told him no interlocking of fingers, and it really has killed the dead time. It really has. What, what fans want to see is action. Up. And that's locking of the fingers is, you can't really get to too much offense off of interlocking of fingers, so you cut that out and it allows for more points on the board, and that's ultimately what the fans want to see. Time for Mustafaev to work. Yeah, unable to improve his position. Restart in the center. It's promising to see that Kaya is out here looking to get to his offense, but really his three shots haven't been set up. They've all been dive attempts. And you usually try and tell wrestlers to pick it up, but at this point, you want to tell him to dial it back just a tad bit if he's not getting to any ties. I want to see him work to set up some sort of offense because at this point, Mustafaev's offense is coming from counter offense. His counter early on in that first period that gave Azerbaijan the 2 nothing lead. Little would we know at that time that that would be the only offense in the opening three minutes, but that certainly is the case. You know there's going to be no panic in Kaya. He's a veteran for Turkey. Second time in a gold medal that we've had Turkey and Azerbaijan collide toe to toe. We go to the second period, gold medal at stake. 70 kilos at these European Championships. And this was a 
allow the sequence to play out before I give my thoughts. This was Jakob Gore's weight class for Turkey, two-time world bronze medalist. So how about this? Gore, two-time world bronze medalist, bumps up from 70 kilos to 74 and takes over the spot from two-time defending champion Sonar Demirtas, who defeated Frank Chimizo last year. So they had a tough decision to make, and Gore ended up losing today. Yeah, Gore did not make it out. But now you start to think moving forward towards the European Games and the World Championships, Gore has more ranking series points, and if he could add to that total with a potential bronze medal here, then do you throw him over Demirtas? That's a difficult choice heading into the World Championships. It's a good choice, though, when you have that type of talent but a stressful one to play the right card. Kaya with the two. See the line underneath the number in the upper left-hand corner. That means he has the criteria. Criteria being the biggest point move is the first one. Both have two pointers, so that's not a factor. Then you go number of cautions. Neither one has a caution, so then you go with the most recent point scored. So that's why Kaya has that advantage but I doubt we're going to be stuck here at two that would be shocking <laughs> we're talking about that a minute 15 from now boy Kaya read that shot coming cut it off before it could get any steam now working on that arm swiveling around to the side in a position to get two has that leg still trapped Mustafaev Trying to split and keep away, but he is corralled at the edge, and there's two more on the roll. Beautifully done by Turkey's Mustafa Kaya. Transition offense. Do not stop. Keep the momentum going. That's exactly what he did. Picked up a shot to the left leg and came with the right side gut, so he just continued the movement. And it's dangerous when you can turn a takedown from two points to four. Chain wrestling right there. 6-2, Kaya with a little bit of breathing room. Mustafayev, who fired the opening two. He launched the offense early in the first period, but that has been it for him. Azerbaijan in some trouble. He keeps lunging, he keeps searching. Kaya too wise, he's not gonna fall into any of these traps. And Turkey is a few moments away from a gold medal. Mustafaev content in this position. He is unable to get the offense. He realized it. Turkey, congratulations. A big smile, a European championship for Mustafa Kaya. Six unanswered points in the second period. Trailed two to zero. Kept his cool, and you mentioned it. Veteran composure. Put six on the board and wins six to two. 